Hi guys, this is Noiser and now I'm really interested to hear your thoughts about the 60Hz servers that we finally got in the last update. Have you noticed any differences? Are you experiencing any improvements or new problems for that matter? Personally, I haven't noticed anything different and I will get back to what I mean with that. But I have though experienced a loss in a ranked game that I've never encountered before. Which is kind of strange, as the kind of problem that made us lose this game, as far as I know, should be a bigger problem with low tick rate servers. So, in this game, Mira was hitting the diffuser without me or my teammates knowing about it. I saw some teammate outlines close to the diffuser and thought they had it covered, so I decided to breach open a wall to get a secure angle towards the diffuser. And as I open it, Mira's already on it and I shoot and kill her, but what do you know? Although I actually killed her, she managed to destroy the diffuser and secure a pretty annoying win, actually. I'm certainly no game server expert, but I guess in the same way as hit registration might be slower with lower tick rate servers, I guess a defender could be killed after they've actually destroyed the diffuser because of the server not registering everything in time as well. What's strange though is that I actually got a kill confirmation on my screen, and the other team must have got a confirmation of a win of course, both which I guess must be sent from the server to each client. Otherwise, it wouldn't show up as a confirmation on our screens. Well, please correct me if I'm explaining anything wrong now, but 60Hz servers basically means that the servers update the game state 60 times every second. 60Hz. So, things that happen, shots being fired, shots registering, characters moving, basically player, players pressing a key or moving a mouse or controller or whatever, can never update faster than 60 times per second by the server. That's extremely fast of course, but the changes that the servers have to register, they have to travel from the player to the server first, which I guess often is a bigger problem in a game, with many players having around 100 in ping. In other words, 100 milliseconds from sending and receiving an answer back from the server. Uh, in my understanding, we had 50Hz servers that now were bumped up to 60Hz, so instead of the servers updating every 20 milliseconds, they now update approximately every 17th millisecond. That's just a difference in 3 milliseconds, if I'm not mistaken, and how much better game experience will that actually give us? I'm extremely positive to all improvements of performance that can make the game experience better, and if you actually have noticed improvements, I would really like to know, since I think it's a bit quiet about this in the, in the community. And also, if the specific experience in my lost game in this video is something you've actually noticed before. I've had like thousands of hours in this game and still I've never experienced this before. Well, that's about it for this one guys. Now please share your thoughts on the 60Hz server update and give me a thumbs up or down so I get some feedback on this. And if you're not already a subscriber, hit that subscribe button and the bell icon next to it to get notified when I post my next video. I'll be back soon again with some more Rainbow Six Siege content and until then, I will keep being noiser. Hey, don't.